Fun with paint In the previous class, we learnt about different tools present on the paint window and few options present on the file menu. Before starting this chapter, let us revise what we studied in the previous class. Paint Paint is a software that helps us to draw, copy and edit pictures using various tools. The topmost bar on the paint window is the title bar. It displays the name of the file and the application. Menu bar is just below the title bar that has different menus or tabs like file, home, view. The paint file tab has different options like new, open, save, save as, exit, etc. There are two scroll bars on the paint window, the horizontal scroll bar and the vertical scroll bar. Make your drawing. You already know how to draw lines, squares, rectangles, ellipses or ovals and circles and some other ready-made shapes given in the shapes group of the home tab. Let us now revise. Select Pencil Fill with color Text Brushes Line Curve Oval Rectangle Rounded rectangle Triangle Polygon Cloud callout Oval callout Rounded rectangular callout Magnifier Color picker Eraser Editing your drawing. After you have made a drawing on paint by using the drawing tools such as pens, brushes, auto shapes, you can color your drawing by using the available color palette and a variety of available colors and textures. Finally, you can save your drawing by going to the save as option in the file menu. You can reopen your drawing by double clicking on the file icon you have saved and edit this drawing by several options. Undo Undo command is used to undo the last action. You can cancel the wrong portion or remove mistakes by using the undo option. You can use Ctrl plus Z keys on the keyboard. For example, Draw a square and then a circle on the drawing area. Now, click on Undo. The Undo option will remove the circle from the screen. Redo If you want to execute the operation again, you can use Redo option. You can use Ctrl plus Y keys on the keyboard. It is the reverse of Undo command. For example, if you want to get the circle back on the screen, which was removed by undo command, click redo option from the quick access toolbar. The circle will appear on the screen. Remember, the undo and redo options have a limit. If you save the document, the undo option will stop working. Cut, copy and paste. If you want to cut a portion of your drawing, or make a duplicate copy of it and place it at another place in the file, then we use cut, copy and paste commands. But before using these commands, it is important to select the portion of drawing that has to be pasted to another place. Selecting your drawing. To select the drawing, click the select tool in the image group of the home tab. Now. Click and hold the left mouse button and drag the mouse over the portion of the drawing until it is completely selected. The selected portion can be seen in the dotted lines. It is now ready to be moved, cut or copied. No more. To draw a perfect circle, hold down the shift key while dragging. Cut. Cut command works like a pair of scissors. It removes the selected portion of image from the drawing area. 
the image removed from cut option is temporarily stored in the clipboard. For example, click on select and select the portion of the image that has to be removed. Now, click on the cut command. You will see that the selected portion disappears from the drawing. Copy Copy command is used to make a duplicate copy of the selected image. It does not remove the selected portion of image from the original image. Instead, it makes a duplicate copy of the selected portion. For example, click on select and select the portion of the image that has to be copied. Now, click on copy command. Paste Cut or copied portion of the image can be placed at any other place in the drawing area or in some other drawing by using paste command. For example, click on select and select the portion of the drawing. Click on cut or copy command. Now, click on paste command. The image will appear on the left hand top corner of the screen. If you select the cut and paste option, the portion of the image that has been selected will be removed from its place and then paste it on a selected new location. But, if you select copy and paste option, a duplicate copy of the image will be created and pasted on the new location. You can use Ctrl plus X keys for cut, Ctrl plus C keys for copy, and Ctrl plus V keys for paste option. Select all. The drawing can be selected manually by using Select tool on the image group of the Home tab. To select the whole drawing automatically, we use Select All command on the Select menu. To use this command, simply draw the image and then click on Select menu and choose Select All option. Entire image will be selected. You can use Ctrl plus A keys for select all option. Delete To delete a drawing or a part of the drawing, first select a part on whole drawing using the select tool. Click on delete from the select option or press the delete key. The selected drawing will be deleted. Save a drawing Press Ctrl plus S keys together from keyboard or Click on File tab and then press Save. In the Save As dialog box, type your file name. Select the file format that you want and then click Save. By default, the file format is .png but you can also save in other formats like .bmp, .jpeg, .jpg, .gif etc.